Okay, so we pull into the campground and we back our camper onto the camping pad. Now, most camping pads are gonna be fairly level, but not all camping pads are. That's where these leveling blocks are gonna come in super handy. Now, I've used blocks of wood and I've also seen those Lego blocks that we stack on one another. You gotta drive up on it and then just try to level it with one inch or two inch. Uh, this right here, you're just gonna be able to roll back and and elevate one side up to four inches. Now, I think these are gonna be super simple. I've never used them before. This is actually gonna be my first time. We're out here in the driveway and I'm off just a couple of inches on being level. And the way we're gonna do this is we're gonna stick these little ramps underneath the tire. And then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna back up. And as I back up, I'm raising the camper to level it left and right. When I get it where I want it to be, then I'm gonna take these blocks and I'm gonna lock that into place and it's not gonna go anywhere. So while I'm in the cab of the truck, my wife is going to be guiding me and letting me know when I'm about midway through the, uh, the ramps here. Now, if you are on gravel, they do give you some sticky pads that you can lay down so that your blocks don't uh, slide across the gravel. You know how irritating that can be. Uh, so we got some little grippers here so that you could use that if you needed to. Being on concrete, I think that we're gonna be okay. After we get up, uh, ever, after everything is said and done, then we do have a nice carrying bag here and you can put it in the storage compartment of your camper and uh, it's not gonna take up too much space. You need to go more? I need to go a little bit more. Okay, so when we get at the campground, we're gonna check our levels. If you don't have a level on your camper already, they do provide you with one. It does have a sticky back to it, and it also does have a couple of holes so that if you wanted to screw it to the side of your camper, you could do that. I would suggest putting it near your jack so that you can raise it up and down and you can see the bubble move as you are making things level. So the way it's gonna work now, we're just gonna stick those chocks in there just like that and it's not gonna go anywhere. We're gonna be safe, we're gonna be settled, and we're gonna be good for, uh, for the camping weekend or for the camping week. Now, in order to get off of these, I could either go ahead and back all the way up and roll out of it, or I can pull forward and, uh, and then we'll be, uh, we'll be off of them and be able to store them away. So let me do that for you. I'm gonna put my wheel chalk here so I know where to stop, and, uh, and then we'll get these put away. And it's just that simple. Now, I've never used leveling blocks before, but I think that these rocker blocks, super easy to use. Getting on, getting off, you can, you can level up to four inches on one side of your camper. Make sure that that bubble is right in the center and you're gonna be good to go for the weekend.